Hi everyone, this is PhD Natural Me and welcome back to my channel. I said I was going to do macadamia nut to determine how much you're taking in gram wise or your gram, fat grams, carbohydrate uh, gram wise. I think it's easier to go by the gram weight because what I'm going to do with this, I'm going to actually grind these up so I can use it in fat bombs. And I'm using my Vitamix. Hey Vitamix. I love Vitamix. I'm not getting paid for Vitamix. They want to pay me, that's fine. But I've used Vitamix for this is 19 years old and I know I said that in my last video. And what's nice about this, I made all my baby food. I made all my whole foods when I was blending things together. And if you want to do uh, anything in your Vitamix. I, I absolutely love it. I When I was making homemade bread, I had a dry container and I would grind up my own wheat, the, the wheat. Can't think of what the name is right now because I don't do that anymore. But I am going to show you this. So what I'm going to do, this container here, my trusty old glasses. One quarter of a cup, 28 grams, equals a total of four grams of carbohydrates, dietary fiber, two. So if you're counting your net, I don't. So I think once I grind it up, I'll still go by weight because it'll be easier. This is my, my, my struggle because I love, I love macadamia nuts. All right, let me tip this down, show you what I'm doing. Oops, do, do, do. If you have one of these, you can put the lid on first and pour it through the opening on the top. If you have the newer ones, they clip on very nice. So I want to put the whole container in. And I have a little small container to put these in after. So here we go. That's about how much I got. Look. Put this on here. You want to make sure, let me t turn it this way. For me, just do it low. That way you can just kind of crumble them. And make sure that if you have the Vitamix, have it on variable, not on high. Because if you have it on high, it's going to just pulverize them. So low, start that. If you need your tamper, I don't think I do, but, and I'm just going to put this lid on for now because I, I just want to crumble. ground. I'm just going to stick to it because it's not that much. Shift it around a little bit. I think I may hit it one more time. I'll show you what I mean after I get all this up at the bottom here. And I'm doing this because I want you to know what it's really like. And what you can do, turn around the other end. But do not do this while it's on the blender. Because if you do, and you accidentally hit one of these little switches, it's going to run. Okay. I'm just going to hit it one more time. That's good. That's all that I want. 
Now I have, and if you keep doing this, it's going to turn into a butter. Nice paste. But that's perfect for me. So, I'll come back with some fat bombs that I'm going to make later. But there is macadamia crumble. Stay healthy. Keep eating keto. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit that like button. Bye. Wait, don't go. I decided to go ahead and make my macadamia nut butter. Because it's nice and creamy. See how creamy it gets? And it would have been a little bit more creamy if I had a had maybe two containers of these. But they're a little on the pricier side. But they're a very good nut. <laughs> like me. Anyway, now I'm going to take this. I'm going to use it for fat bombs. Maybe use it as a, a little bit of a spread on my uh, coconut bread or my almond microwave bread. Or if I get a little hungry and I'm low on fat, that's what I do. So, my Vitamix, nut butter, stay healthy, keep eating keto. Bye.